Well, hello, people. Lately, my friend has been this this box here. Because my nose is clogged. I don't know exactly what the causes of this. I think it was Thursday night was the day. Wednesday I had gone on a run, wasn't too happy with myself, so I thought Thursday I was gonna come back and run a full 5K. And that's what I did, I ran pretty good. I ran a 24.05, five seconds off. It was a good run, I ran the whole way. However, once I came home, took a shower, and once I was about ready to go to bed, I just felt a little a little something, a little something in my throat. But once I got up in the morning, I felt that just kind of flow down the throat. My nose was not clogged, but my throat killed me. And uh, I was a little pounding in the head, but not quite horribly. But then I went to school, first, second hour was fine. Um, which was good because second hour I had a quiz that I really needed to be focused on. And then, once I got to third period, my nose started to fill up, and then lunch, it continued to fill up. Fifth hour, I was like, dang, this is going to be the longest afternoon of my life. And it was, it was the longest afternoon of my life, but I was able to grind grit. Came home, I drove home, which was probably not the best idea, but I didn't get in a car wreck. And then, I came home, took a shower, and slept. Yeah, so that that was my uh, eventful. I'm feeling a little more enlightened this morning. Feel a little more energy, so I'll try to build on that. Even though I have this cold, I wanted to dive into something today. Last weekend it became daylight savings time, and and that's where I wanted to start today's topic at. I want to talk a little bit about daylight saving time and the sun, and kind of how it affects us as people, but. More or less here in the Midwest, we do have a lot of changing of daylight and darkness. Not as much as the Arctic, but it's still quite heavily compared to the equator in southern states of the United States. I filmed the sun a lot, so I came, came to realize the position of the sun at what time of the year it is. So, for example, um, in my backyard, I can track the sun very good because the house right behind us um, kind of acts as the vantage point, but in the summer it's on the far right of the house and I can get the sun setting behind it and the house next to it. Then um, now during the year it's shifted south because the sun has to, um, the, sun, the sun doesn't cover the sky as much so it takes a shorter angle across the sky and that's why it causes it to set more south in my perspective and that's why it sits behind that house. To be honest, I never even realized how much the sun actually moves and how fast it actually moves until I started taking time lapses. It's gotta get across from point A to point B in about 10 hours, so it's clicking. The idea of daylight savings time was proposed by Benjamin Franklin. And daylight savings time hasn't been around that long, to be honest. Um, it's actually younger than my both of my parents. It was first proposed by Benjamin, Benjamin Franklin in like 1790s um, to give Americans uh, more sunlight in the summer because daylight savings time affects the summer, not the winter. The winter is the standard time, if you didn't know that. I actually didn't know that. I thought it affected the winter. But it actually affects the summer. The idea was to, because it would get really bright, it would get bright at about 4.30 in the summer, to start the day and the sun would set at 7, 7.30. But they wanted to move it back an hour to give um, people more of the opportunity to go outside until 8.30 and cut off that and start the day at 5.30, which is a brilliant idea. And the federal law amended it in 1986. Pretty young, did not realize that at all. I thought it had been like for 500 years. So there's your fun fact of the day, kind of interesting.
nearly noon, still blowing my nose. It's been a very long day, very boring day. This might make it better. It's so smooth, you go right down the throat. I hate being sick because you can't be productive when you're sick. I'm making it, we're making a change tonight. We're gonna go out. We have to go look at some Christmas stuff, so. Well, finally, an excitement for the day. If you made it to this point in the video, you're a trooper. Beautiful evening, very humid. We're walking to Dick's.